Yeah, it's a great day for football in this lovely stadium. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. The action is league football today against Bochum, against St Pauli. I think the first ten minutes might tell us how this match is going to pan out, who can gain the upper hand, who can get hold of this ball and ask all the questions. The line-up for the home side. Responsibility for some of those five in midfield to get forward and uh, I'm sure the, the main striker won't be isolated, although it looks a bit like that on our screens. Yeah, he could be a lonely man up top there if he doesn't get the support that uh, he needs because he is the type of player that does need support. He can't do it all on his own. This is the St Pauli lineup. He looks as though the manager has set up a team here. Whatever happens, we're not going to be beaten today. Does look that way, doesn't it? And uh, I hope it's not a dull affair, this, because we've seen this manager set up teams in the past and just concentrating on a clean sheet. The waiting is over, the game is off and running, and so are the players. Made sure the pass wasn't completed. Well, they couldn't keep possession, they've given it away. They can spread the play now. Trying to find an opportunity. And the referee spotted that deflection, he's pointed for the corner. <laughs> Swung in from the corner. Well, the play is broken down now. Test of his control now. Not going to go for that yellow card here, just a free kick. <laughs> Tackled well there. Going forward with real purpose now. Well, the referees decided to give the penalty, and it's a chance now to take the lead. Well, could be a vital decision, this one, and looking at it, I think he was correcting it. Sliding in and uh, taking his part in the game into uh, uh, a dangerous territory, really. Well, different referees take different views of these kind of sliding tackles. It was fairly dangerous. He scored from the spot.
for a striker. It's not quite a gimme, but it's certainly one that he wanted to take. Never any doubt for me. Very assured walking up to that. So the first goal, it's 1-0. So easy in possession. Wanting that. The chance for the equaliser. Push back out into play. Really gone to blast it goalwards, but it's into the crowd. Yeah, that's not a great one. Robert Tesh. It's about finding the right pass now. Great tackling technique to win the ball cleanly. Room in which to attack. On the cross, blocked well by the defender. No way through for the shot, blocked. Robert Tesh can find some space here on the flanks. Is this the moment? Keeper called into action and ready for it. Corner's going to be taken short this time. He's looking to get in and fire a shot off here. He went in well. Referee says free kick. This could be promising. Looking for teammates in the middle. Well, poor pass, good interception. Take your choice. Get this corner right, and they could be level. Corner's taken. Well, it's come to nothing in the end. Being challenged here. Couldn't hold on to the ball. Well, that's half-time at 1-0. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Yeah, I thought he looked lively in that first half. Really sharp and obviously got the goal. Another 45 of that and he'll be well pleased. And here we go, the referee's blown his whistle, and we're off for the second half. Into the attacking third. Encouraging play from this team now, keeping the ball. And the defender has blocked the cross, and he's done it well. Good awareness by the referee to play the advantage here.
Teammates getting out of the way because they know he can dribble it here. Oh, what a touch by the defender. He was so quick to get into position, to get his body in the way there. Keeping calm in the pursuit of uh, an equalising goal here, not panicking, and he could get away here. Ah, the keeper's done well to keep that one out. Gives it away. Chance to get forward from the wing. Maybe the cross. Cross has come to nothing. We've reached the hour mark. Half an hour to go. Robert Tesh. Difficult for the defender against the player who wants to take him on like this. Rio Miyaichi. That's a great interception. Probing pass. Goal! They lead by two now. Took the chance nicely. And that really has given them much more of a basis for the rest of this match. And you've got to be impressed with that. The way he's put his foot through it and found the bottom right corner. Let's see the replay now. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Not really creating enough pressure, keeping the ball here. Saw the goal and went for it. Back into play off the crossbar. The hosts had more than enough of the ball today, and we've been treated to some really good football because with that possession, they've created a lot of chances and made life awfully difficult for the opposition. Deserved leaders so far. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. Tackled well. Looking for goal now. And that's a, a save for the goalkeeper. team want to make a change it's the expected move the extra striker for the team that's struggling well that's going to ask some different questions of that defense can they cope still got a bit to do but this is promising had a go simple save from an ambitious effort And on the clock, eight more minutes. Well, they've got the opposition on the back foot with this break. They're coming at them with numbers. The referee in control because he's seen the advantage and indicated to the players to play on. Great interception. Plenty of power, but not too much direction. <laughs> A 
and it's come to an end now as the referee blows the whistle for the last time. Can't get much better than this, really, Alan, to win and keep a clean sheet. Yeah, I think that would be the pleasing aspect of it, as well as the three points, the clean sheet, uh, particularly the keeper. I'd be delighted with that. Well, I think he was the best performer in a good team today. Yeah, I mean, we thought he might be the danger man out there, Martin, didn't we? And that's how it turned out. Probably the difference between the two teams.